are here at IMTS 2024 in the Mazak booth with Jason Taylor. Mazak here is featuring their VC Easy 20X. Jason, I'm going to turn it over to you. Why don't you give us an overview of this machine and the advantages that Mazak has added to the VC Easy 20? Thanks, Shay. So one of the best advantages we've added to this machine is this is the next size up from our initial 16X offering that we've had for about two years now. Um, it still shares the commonality of parts with our other VC Easy series, which keeps our price point very competitive. But on this machine in particular, we're showing off the 20,000 RPM spindle, which is going to be on the 16X end as well as this 20X. That is fantastic. And this machine is built in the USA. Can you talk about the production down in Kentucky? Absolutely. So we're very proud to be made in the USA. So this is the latest offering again is our 20X, and we have several in, in this booth right now. All the VC Easy and the QT Easy machines are made proudly in Kentucky. Uh, completely, and if anybody ever wants to come and see it, the proof's in the pudding. Come down to Florence, Kentucky and see them. You absolutely should. Anyone should take you up on that offer. And with this lineup of machines, can you give us kind of, maybe is this better for job shops, mid-production, high-production shops? Where are you guys seeing the most interest from in the industry? Uh, we usually see it as in job shops and entry-level people trying to get into the 5-axis market. It's fully capable of running production series. We have a lot of automation options that you can get on this machine. Uh, Price point, it usually falls into more of the job shop and entry level, though. Fantastic. And then kind of just to touch on the control a little bit, mm -hmm. what type of control do you guys have? And does it have Mazatrol and EIA? Yes, it does. So one of the common myths is that we don't have G-code on our controllers, but in actuality, this is our Smooth EZ5 controller. Uh, we introduced this with our five-axis machines, obviously. It is fully G-code, ISO G-code compatible, but we also have all the full function of our major control programming that we're very proud of and we've had for decades. Fantastic, and training. I know Mazak has some really good offers with training when you guys buy a new machine. Mm -hmm. Would you be able to touch on that a little bit? Yep, all of our machines come with three years unlimited training in Florence, Kentucky. Uh, that is for programming classes. We also do offer hot classes and service classes for a fee. Okay, and I do have one more question pertaining to the five axis side of things. So uh, when it comes to switching into a five axis, do you truly need a five axis part? I feel like a lot oh, of customers, yeah. they're like, oh, I don't have true five axis. Right. I don't need the simultaneous. What, what's your advice to them? So the vast majority of people that buy five axis machines, this is a fully uh, capable five axis machine. But realistically, people usually do it three plus two is what we call it, okay. where they position and, and drill apart on the side and cut some flats, flap it. That's the majority of the people that actually use these machines. And the advantages of switching to the five axis? Um, so a lot of people will take one part that has like a five side feature on it, and they have to do multiple setups on the three axis machine. On this machine, you do two setups, one for the bottom, and then you can do all the other five sides in one setup. Fantastic, Jason, thank you so much for being with us. If you guys have any questions, please be sure to reach out to Mazak and visit them here at IMTS 2024. Thanks, and we'll see you next time.